Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to the 3rd of April. Just broke above freezing here a little bit ago. It was 28 degrees this morning we got up. Man, oh man. But what a difference a day makes. You know, it's funny, it's yesterday, Kelly and I were out back there, and she was going, yeah, tomorrow will be the nice day. And, of course, it is. Why is it always nicer on the on the work days and the weekends when you're free to go play. <laughs> yeah, it's got a bit of a bark to her, doesn't it? Yes. You ready to roll out? Yep, we got it. All right, let's head for Van Chulo. <laughs> Cold or not, I'll take the sunshine. That's nice. Well, Mama, that is one huge swing in temperature. Yeah goes from 33 or 34 whatever it was there at the house to 48 here yeah it didn't didn't have the bite to it here like it did and <laughs> goofball look at her she's got layers of stuff on about 80 yet <laughs> all righty so i don't know if you guys read the description in the video motorcycle loyalty i put a link to a video this is the piece of paper at the beginning of that video that the guy's scanning and pulling all the parts for the bike. This follows the bike all the way through in uh, Berlin where they're built. And uh, I put this in the deal packet and this is given to the cut. It's all in German. But I think it's a really cool novelty thing to know that this was the beginning of the bike. And that uh, all the processes that led to this thing being in the crate began in the in the factory with that sheet. This is a uh, beautiful red, white, and blue 2017 S1000RR. I think our uh, parts manager is going to take this. He's our he's our resident road racer. But uh, I'll pull her out of the crate and let you see what she looks like. Dang. That sucker is pretty. That's the, the official BMW racing colors. Oh man. She's pretty. Still got all her crate dust on her. You gotta give her an air bath as soon as you get it on your bench. <laughs> it's just dust from the wood when they're putting it together. Heck yeah. So our parts manager's been waiting for this thing forever. I guess this color's rare or something. I have no idea, but it, it was hard to get. So uh, he brought it in on the forklift, and and uh, Kelly got busy up there, so he ran up there to help her. So he didn't see inside the box. So I go up there and I go, ah. Oh. So we got a problem. So two problems actually. I said the second, the first one doesn't really matter because of the second one. He goes, oh no, what? I said the thing doesn't have any keys with it. He goes, oh no. I said, but that doesn't matter. I said, the label inside the box is wrong. It's not the red, white, and blue. It's the gray one. And he's like, oh, you're kidding me. I said, sorry, man. April Fool's. I said, I wasn't here Saturday to get an April Fool's joke on you. He goes, smoke, damn you. <laughs> God, him good. You should have seen the look on his face. Poor guy. It made his heart sink. But I'll get his, his 1000 RR all put together for him here today. I know someone that might be taking this away. <laughs> oh, yeah. Coolidge. The ever so lovely rally. Just waiting for the battery to come up and we'll plug her into BMW here and get everything all set. Was will have himself a go fast road racer. That's one bad boy right there. It's been beautiful out here all day. It's been this weird little haze, but that don't matter. It's still been really beautiful. I haven't had a chance to ride anything today. That's a bummer. Check that out. An R1200R. Very nice. Ready to head for the Hacienda. I think it's only supposed to get in the upper 50s. 
I think it blew right past that. Yeah. I don't know. Well, the heat coming out of this car is intense. Probably yeah. But we're getting out of here a half hour late. Nice thing is all the bikes, all the customers riding up on their bikes. Yeah. Sun comes out and here comes the mo pickles. All kinds of stuff out here. It's really cool. Yeah, we definitely definitely exceeded the the high fifties. 89 here in the car. 65 outside. That's nice. Real nice. Too bad I'm not on the boat pickle. It's all kinds of sunny. It's still 59 degrees here in Toledo. It's the ultra limited. Guys out enjoying their motorcycles today. Now as you can see, I didn't, didn't cover up the old Harley. Maybe I'll come out here tonight or tomorrow and do it. The old Beamer. No sense in covering that thing up. It's already dirty. Well, she's for dirt and stuff. <laughs> silly man. Oh man, these peaceful spring evenings. It would be nicer if it was bluer skies, but yeah, you take what you get. A little stack of hay for the for the old hee haws. There's peace and serenity out in the fields. <laughs> There's a little thing when we start these videos that <laughs> she sticks her tongue out at me, so I always always laugh at that thing. So I always start the videos laughing. But I don't know if she's just trying to offset me or just relax me. Foul me up or what what it is. First of all, you know, we recently, well, what is today, 505, so yeah. five days ago, we celebrated our 500th uh, vlog in a row, and super nice guy, Dan from Maine, sent us this card. That is so cool. He noticed it's, it's 500. <laughs> One yeah, of the things good. he wrote in the bag, he goes, sorry about the card, I can't imagine all the happy 500th vlog cards. Um, we're all sold out, so I had to make this one work. <laughs> anyway, so super nice thing. Get every everything that was 50th, he turned to 500 and turned to vlogs and stuff. Anyway, super super nice uh, card and a lovely lovely letter accompanying the uh, card. And if we ever, he's from Maine. If we ever end up there, uh, bike week up there, I guess is phenomenal. I, I've I've heard. Sorry, guys, that's just the oven. Oh, is just it? Just ignore it. It's is not that, ready. Oh, okay. I don't just, know if we had to do something now or, but um, anyway, bike week up there that would be, that would be so much yeah. fun. It's so beautiful up there. Always wanted to go. There. Yeah, and uh, I I know we've as a kid, was up there with parents and stuff, and I I just don't know. I know it looks has that feeling of kind of like the northwest it seems like everything's green and if i remember right i've you know i was a wee little guy i was up that way but uh anyway i would love to take a trip up there and be there for bike week yeah that would be that would be epic yeah one of these days just be able you know that's one of the things you had to do a little thing about the bike loyalty thing and one of the things is the guys um talking about all these places they go and i'm just like where do you find the time? You know, some of them are retired, so, you know, they have all the time in the world to do these crazy trips. But some of them just, that's how they do their vacations, you know? Yeah. Just take these long, crazy trips. That would and be And awesome. I love that kind of stuff. I love taking those those trips like we do with the YouTube meetups. And Kelly and I, of course, we didn't, weren't able to do anything last year because of all the BMW training and stuff was interfering with it was a timing thing you know but uh anyway a lot of fun yeah, tons of fun that would be lots of fun i would i'd love to come see and hang out he says got a room for you if you ever want to come up here there's some kind of oh probably cat was up here yeah written never on the table. ending kitty but uh that was did i tell you about the april fools i played on oz uh-uh uh, it's about that red white and blue 
It's a special racing color. It's the official yeah. racing color for BMW. Anyway. Did I you told, get him good? Yeah. Like he uh, says, well, if you want me to build that thing, you had to dig it out because it was buried behind a bunch of other bikes because we've been getting bikes in again like crazy of, of other brands. And uh, there's several BMWs down there. I thought it was just two left. But uh, they keep sneaking in on me. But uh, anyway, I, I explained it to them. But oh. anyway, I went up there and said there was a problem. I said, but the first problem doesn't really matter because the second problem ends the deal. I was, What's that? I said, well, there's no keys with it. I said, I know you can order keys. I said, but I'm, you're not going to care about that because the labeling on this box is wrong. I said, I pulled the carton off. It's gray. He's like, oh, just the look on his face just is sinking. He's been waiting forever for this thing. Oh, bless his yeah, heart. Like, oh, I'm just messing with you. I wasn't here on Saturday to play an April Fool's joke on you. So, so here it is. <laughs> it was, oh, dang you smoke. I was very happy. Oh, very cool. Yeah, but we didn't play any April Fool's on each other, so I... And it was James who was the seed to this. He oh. goes, go out there tell Oz there's no keys for it. I go, I'll do one better than that. I'll tell them it's the wrong color to boot. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, they're always playing jokes on each other. Yeah, that's a lot of fun. We have a lot of fun there. It's yeah. a lot of fun. That's a good place. We all enjoy the sport. You know, like a lot of you guys that watch these things, you, you know, I, I would guess probably the majority of you in some way or another are in the motorcycles. Because it's so motorcycle, Related. I mean, it's our lives, you know, unless you just like to listen to a couple of people act like idiots, you probably in some way like, used to ride, still yeah. ride, or looking at riding, but yeah, it's fun, it's a fun sport, the customers are fun, the employees are fun, yeah, it's, it's, it's a good bunch yeah. of people, yeah. it really is. It's weird we sell so many brands and, you know, it's nice to see, you know, like employees. Every once in a while you get an employee that's very brand loyal or whatever. But for but, the uh, most part, yeah. everybody, if it's a motorcycle, we like yeah, it. It doesn't matter whether it's, you know, an Indian BMW, a used Harley we took in or... Honda, Yamaha, It's, it's a motorcycle, you yeah. know, we're all enjoying the same thing. And uh, on that loyalty thing, the, some of the comments you guys had was fantastic. Just talking about, I don't care if it's two wheels, three wheels. And I'm like, man, after my own soul. Yep. If it's a motorcycle, it's fun. And everybody has their own taste, you know. Oh, yeah. Whether, you know, it's a bike I like or, or not. It's, it's cool that you like it. That yeah. you're out there riding it. You because know? it's a bike. That's all that counts. But there's a lot of cool comments with that. Some people thought I was bad. No, not I was bad mouthing, but I think they may have felt I was downing other ones. I I, I wasn't. I was just the the excitement. No, well, never and I was speaking new. with a friend about about a BMW, so it got me going. I'm just thinking, man, after that grand opening and open house thing we had, it you know, uh, you know, just a shocking amount of people with a loyalty to those things. Yeah, that's I was just, way cool. It was just an excited moment. <laughs> I get on these little rolls every once in a while. Yeah. Kelly goes, dear God. He does. Really bad sometimes, guys. I get overexcited. I get very not excited you know riding motorcycles. Because I, I love the ones that shock me. Yeah. And the best, the best surprise I've had in a long time was that little, was it a G, G650 CS or F650 CS? that weird looking thing that had, I don't know, it almost looks like a bucket that you could put a spare helmet in there. It had that weird thing on the tank. Just a peculiar looking bike. And uh took that thing for a test ride and I, I was, that was probably the most shocked I've been riding a uh -huh. motorcycle. I just really had no expectations with this bike at all. That, that was a 03. Rode that thing around like, what the heck? It it's a cool felt good. Thing. As soon as I went rolling down the ramp, and just the, just the seating position and where the pegs were and everything, I'm going, what the heck? This thing's cool. And it's plenty fast, 650 thumper. I don't know why that just surprised me. Every time I ride that DR650, I do the same thing. I go, what the heck? This thing's got all kinds of power. Yeah. And it's, it's like, fast. Yeah, it's like, what? I mean, you can cruise 
cruise all day at 80, 90 miles an hour on that thing. I was like, wait a minute, this is a single. You know, it should be buzzing and shaking and feeling all wobbly down the road. It goes down the road like a bullet. It's fun. And your sound effects. <laughs> well, Mama, you let me talk about motorcycles once again. I know. Sometimes I just fail on my job. But there was there. a little diversion we had yes. Dan in Maine with his card. <laughs> I love him making a 500 out I of that know, thing. That's way cool. 500 blocks. That's crazy. I still, I think about that every once in a while. I'm just going, what the heck? Dang, we? We've been doing this for a while. Yeah. It is weird to go back and look at look at old stuff. Yeah. It's weird. And it yeah. was just going to be a thing to fill in yeah. during the winter when I couldn't ride. I was just going to do a little motorcycle talky thing, show you how I do things at work and stuff like that. And they go, not you can show the motorcycles, stuff. but you cannot show, working, show on working on a customer's bike or explaining yeah. what you're doing to a customer's bike. That could get twisted. And be, oh, yeah. Be sitting in front of a judge. <laughs> I'm not. I don't want to do that. People are way too sue happy. It's crazy. I'm not. There are some bad apples out yeah. there. Anyway, we're about ready. Mm -hmm. The oven's gonna beep again. Oh, it's gonna beep again in four minutes. So yeah, there it go. Because then I'll go. What is that? Why sound? is that annoying sound? <laughs> it is very <laughs> loud. Alrighty, you guys take care. Thank you very, very much for watching. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And you guys have a wonderful day tomorrow. Sounds like a plan. And try to stay dry in the south because you're just being lambasted. Oh, are they getting hit? Oh, Lord have mercy. Oh, man. That's no good. Yeah, it's bad. So we're getting a couple of nice days and you guys are getting the bad days? Yep. Why can't we all just, just get, get along? along. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't we all just have sunshine? Yeah, sunshine and beautiful weather. Yeah, rain from 2 to 3 in the morning and that's it. Mm. Always be green. Oh, when I was there, dry. we'll see what that is. But I got a little notice in my P.O. box. It was oh, something yeah. that wouldn't fit in. I don't know why they don't just stick them in the boxes and throw it. Oh, because I got a sign for it. Oh, yeah. But uh, um, a parcel of some sort. It just says parcel. That that could be a letter. Yeah. But I got something coming from, uh, or that arrived from Australia. Yeah. So that'll be interesting tomorrow. Yeah, we'll that'll see. be cool. Can't wait to figure out what it is. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. We've already said our goodbyes. So we're out. So we're out. <laughs> Just thinking if we could say a few more. I know it. All right. You guys take care. Until tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks Bye. now. Bye-bye. <laughs>